Hey guys, it's Hannah, and this is my eyebrow tutorial. Okay, so here I have nothing on my eyebrows. These are my natural brows. I wanted to show you guys what it looks like when I don't have any product on my brows. The brush I use to do my brows is the Anastasia Duo Brush number 12. It has an angle on one side and a spoolie on the other. For this tutorial, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in Medium Brown. Definitely my go-to. Okay, so I'm going to start by using the spoolie end of the brush. And with that, I'm just going to brush through my brows and make sure that all the hairs are going the same direction. Next, I'm going to take the angled side of the brush and I'm going to dip it into the dip brow. I don't want to get too much on the brush because I don't want the brush to be saturated. Then I'm going to rub the product on the back of my hand to flatten out the brush. I'm going to then start outlining the underneath part of my brow or the bottom part of my brow and I'm not going to start at the very beginning, I'm going to start more towards the middle. After making sure the line I've just created is the way I want it to be, I will start filling in any sparse areas following the natural shape of my brow with whatever product is still left on my brush. Once I've filled in the natural shape of my brow, I will then start to carve out the tail or the outer end of my eyebrow. And then working my way to the arch and middle part of my brow, I will continue to shape my brow carefully and lightly building the desired shape little by little. I use the spoolie end of the brush to buff out or soften any harsh lines. Here you can see the difference in my eyebrows, one with product and one without. I will go back in and over any spots I may have missed before starting on the beginning part of my eyebrow, or the part that's closest to my nose, which I always save for last. The reason I do the beginning part of my brow last is because I put the least amount of product on that area. I want to use whatever product is left on my brush filling in any sparse areas with soft and light brush strokes for a more natural ingredient look. Once again, using the spoolie to buff out any harsh lines before I dip back into the dip brow to start the process on the other side. Now I'm going to repeat the same steps on my other brow. Finally, I check both sides to make sure my brows are even, touching up anything I may have missed. Lastly, I use the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel to hold my brows in place. And I'm done! Unfortunately, the lighting in this video made my brows look a little uneven because there was actually a large window to my right during the filming of this tutorial. but. That's okay because brows are supposed to be sisters and not twins anyways. But thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my eyebrow tutorial. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.